And now joining us here on NCAA March Madness Skype session, Jordan Howard. Uh, we just recently talked to his brother, Marcus Howard, who had 52 points in Marquette's victory over Providence on Wednesday night. So Jordan, who, by the way, and we're going to get to this, is the number seven scorer in the country, uh, averaging 23.7 points a game. Your younger brother is number 37 in the country, I think before last night, at 20.7 points per game. So let's first deal with your brother's output. What was your reaction when you saw that he scored 52 points? Yeah, insane. It was crazy. Um, the thing was, we played last night, and unfortunately, we lost a tough one. So I was kind of down. But then one of my teammates showed me his phone, and it had like a notification from ESPN saying he had 52 points. And I was like, I was like, that's insane. And so like, I immediately just got out of my own shell and, and was happy for him and wanted to reach out to him and was just just such a special moment. And so the moment wasn't about me, it was about him. So I was so happy and excited for him. And it was just crazy to see all the attention he was getting. So you are a great scorer in your own right. 35 mm -hmm. points against uh, Oregon and UCLA, two of your so, bigger games that you guys have had at Central Arkansas uh, this season. So put in perspective, you know, the way in which the two of you are able to score at such high volume this season. Yeah, it's just a, a mindset and a commitment we both put towards each other and individually as well. We, we both work extremely hard. Um, our older brother does a great job in the summers getting us ready for the season. Our dad does a great job training. Our mom does a great job uh, keeping us uh, healthy and, <laughs> and cooking all the food. So, I mean, it's a complete family affair and like, and we just really encourage each other and really uh, get after each other and just push each other to be the best that we can be. And so that's always been our mindset. We're not the biggest guys, but uh, we always have that mindset of coming in and uh, performing to the best of our abilities and, and using the gifts that God's given us. So that's just something that we've always done. And after every game, we talk to each other, we push each other, we challenge each other. And so it's just great to see that uh, some of our work is paying off. So I asked Marcus this question. You guys are from Chandler, Arizona. I know the Russ Pinnell connection was yes, at Arizona State for a long time, obviously. He's the head coach at Central Arkansas. Uh, but still, you're at Central Arkansas. Your brother's at Marquette. Um, at any point, did either one of you want to go or try to go or you know, convince Arizona, Arizona State uh, to take you guys? I mean, one of our dreams is always to play together. And, and so me coming out of high school, I wasn't – being highly recruited like Marcus was. I had a couple of summers where I was injured, uh, a couple of unfortunate events, but I really had no option to go to any school other than Central Arkansas because Coach Russ was really the only coach since my freshman year of high school that believed in me. So when I came through my senior year and he got the job at Arkansas, I was like, I have no idea what's out there, but I'm going to trust him. I'm, I'm going to know that he's going to put the ball in my hands and trust me to do what I can do. And so coming out of high school, I didn't have that option and that luxury in Marcus being one of the high, highly recruited athletes in his class. Um, he had a bunch of options, but 